And all of a sudden we're realizing that the guards are away. And the screaming and, 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 the, and the camp was uh, wild screaming you heard from all over. And I take a look, the skeletons walking. That was the sick people, you see. They didn't give them any clothing in the barrack. Skeletons holding together. I myself was that way, but uh, they were holding together and walking. It's like the big matches. When I see the big matches, I see the legs of the of the. And uh, the guards are gone, and the news came that the American tank is at the entrance of the camp. With all my might, with all the things, I ran there. And that's a scene I will never forget. I pulled myself uh, I never thought that this inferior inferno will ever come to an end. I pulled myself up, climbed up on the tank, it was thrown down a few times. I climbed up and I hugged the soldier. I hugged the soldier. I was relieved. I was, my hunger went away. I went back to the barracks. And I fell asleep. Hungry and everything, I fell asleep. And I had a terrible dream. I saw the smoke from the chimneys coming down to the camp from the crematorium smoke. And I, I got awakened. I got awakened from an American tank passing in the camp. I was so beautiful that this world woke me up. 